Well, hey there, everybody. Aaron here. Welcome to another episode of Gideon's Tactical. Today, we're going to do a review on the Energizer Romeo Tactical Hard Case Flashlight. This is a little inexpensive. I would say EDC, tactical, you know, wilderness, any, basically anything you need a flashlight for. I think a lot of you guys maybe who need flashlights around the job site are going to love this little energizer basically pocket size flashlight i'm gonna give you a couple basic specs kind of show you how it works and what i love about it i've been rocking it for a while and i really really enjoy using this little energizer first thing is that it's american made that's pretty impressive you know it's not very rare that you'll find uh you know particularly at this price point right around 25 bucks a flashlight much less a lot of other items you know american made so this is built here in the usa that's always a plus it takes one double a battery i always love that double a's i don't like a lot of flashlights that have you know you know, these specialty batteries that are hard to find. I like stuff that's either AAA or AA, easily found batteries, easily to buy. So one AA battery lasts you eight hours on full runtime with just one setting of lumens, 47 lumens, and it is an FL1 bulb. It throws 38 meters is the light throw, and it's a pretty wide, kind of almost a spotlight type of throw is what you're getting with this little Romeo. You're going to fall in love with this guy. Two ounces with the battery. Super lightweight. Love that. Two ounces. It will work for 30 minutes at one meter underwater. So that's interesting. I doubt very many of you are going to use this as an underwater flashlight, but you could do that if you had to. And then it comes with a couple, a couple other little features that I really, really like that we're going to begin to kind of look at here. I'll just give you a final shot of it kind of in my hand. It's pretty small. You can see there, you know, when I was looking it up, I didn't really see any specs. I thought it would be a lot bigger. You know, I thought it basically would be like a full-size, old-school, you know, Vietnam, World War II, you know, little flashlight. Click it on here for you. Boo! Boo! Uh, but it's pretty small. Really nice and super lightweight. Two ounces. Freaking love that. All right, let's go ahead and look at a couple things, little options that they give you with the Energizer Romeo. All right, then we got the little push button. You can see right there, it is kind of rubberized a little bit, so it's nice and soft to the touch, easy to engage. I'm just going to kind of show you here on the ground. Boom, clicked in. We're good to go. Click it off, or you can just tap it if you need to. Very easy to operate the little switch button. Again, there is no you know low or high setting. It's just on or off. That's all you got, but uh, very easy to use, that little top button switch right there. Boop, boop. Very easy to use on the Energizer Romeo. I tried looking up a bunch of specs on the case that this is made out of. I can't really give you any very specific. It's not aluminum or steel. It is a polymer type of plastic. It is. It does say that it can take pretty hard abuse. It's called a hard case. You know, if you drop it, you know, while you're walking around or whatever, it's not going to break on you. Uh, but you know, if you step on it really hard or ran over it, I'm sure it would crack and break because it is some sort of polymer plastic. But I have no specs for you. Looked on the Energizer website, didn't really give me anything. Give you a little loop back here so you could attach it to a lanyard. You know paracord you could run through there or you know attach it some other type of different way right back there on the back of the lens and then down here they give you two separate lenses that screw into the bottom so right now they're secure they're not coming off you can see there so I'm going to take these off right here this is the red one so you can see right there now I got the little red lens real nice that they offer and give you and it just screws right on into place there Real nice, easy to do with these little notches all the way around so you can kind of grab it, jimping, if you will, on your flashlight. And then, boom, you click it into place. There's your red, you know, which helps preserve your night vision. is very hard to spot at night anyway on top of that. And it kind of, you know, deadens the throw as well so that, you know, you're not as bright. If you are walking around, you're, you know, getting chased or something apparently. Or you just need to protect your night vision, you know, as you're walking around the campsite and you just don't need a lot of throw. And again, we'll show these all in the dark here in just a second. But there is is the red then you can see there I still got the blue so they give you a blue lens as well that's even less light and I will unscrew that and they just stack the little lenses just stack on top of each other I'll just unscrew this one right there again kind of screws there at the bottom and then you would unscrew that and your uh, one AA battery is in there, so now the blue lens is on. I can screw on the red lens back into place, so I, you never lose the lenses or have to kind of try and keep 
track of them. So now we got the blue lens. Whoosh, there you go. You can kind of see there. Uh, you know, the blue lens is pretty gimmicky. You know, it's supposed to be for infrared and different things like that. You know, kind of as a signal flare, if you will, so that people can see in like infrared. Um, okay, if you're buying this and you have infrared, you probably uh, you know there's something wrong. You know, this is twenty five dollars. There's probably better products on the on the market if you're needing to be seen through infrared than this little guy. It does offer it to you. Big whoop. I will probably never use it, and it does deaden the light the most. So the throw is pretty small and uh, the circumference is pretty small when you're using the blue, then slightly more with the red, and then full on with no filters on. But it's very cool that they give you those little filters, particularly the red. I definitely do use the red a lot when I'm out, you know, camping and things like that. And, you know, you just don't want to ruin your night vision if you're looking at the stars or just hanging out. You know, the, the options with the filters are very cool and that they attach, you know, underneath on the bottom of the handle is very, very cool as well. All right, well, as we're out here today, some of this I got to shoot during the daytime. You'll see some night shots as well, so you can see how this throws, but I can't do the whole video at night, obviously, is that it comes with a little clip that is designed for Molly and will feed through, I would say, 90% of Molly. We'll show that here in a second. That is very nice and strong. It is removable as well if you want to. I have this on my Hill People kit bag. Real nice. You know, I could definitely hike with it. I wouldn't be running and gunning with it attached this way, but, uh, you know, I can tip it down if I need to get into my pack and see what's in my pack, and then... And I can kind of just rotate it. Whoosh, there it is. Very nice. So you can attach it to all sorts of different stuff. You can kind of wear it on your pocket, on your hip. You know, you could put it on a headband that you're wearing, you know, just like a bandana if you needed to. Lots of different little attachment features that that little clip gives you. Try and get it into screen here for us. There we go. So that uh, this little clip gives you. It's nice. It's probably aluminum or stainless steel but it rotates 360 degrees, but it's got good retention, and then you can take it off if you want to. And it has two little magnets right here. We'll test that out in just a second. So you can magnetize this, particularly that's why I said some of you worker guys, you know, you'd, you're you on job sites and you maybe, you know, small detailed stuff. You can, you know, anything that's steel, that's magnetic, you can attach this little guy to and give you some extra light if you need it with this uh, Energizer Romeo. So that little pocket clip will attach through Molly and all sorts of different stuff. Real nice little design that they give you on the Energizer Romeo. And finally, here's the pocket clip on Molly like it's designed to be. And you can see they're real nice, tight and snug on that loop of Molly. Not gonna wiggle around, you know, so if you're running and gunning, I mean, it's really secure. And this is about all the, you know, jarring you're gonna get. Very nice and tight, can't pull it out of that Molly. I literally have to kind of bend it off and slide it out and tug to remove that pocket clip from the Molly. So great little pocket clip design on the Energizer Romeo. Okay, here's another quick example of how awesome these little magnets are on this little Romeo for car work. It's gonna be fantastic. I'm gonna magnetize it just to the hood of my car. You know, if I had broken down, I'm gonna kill the lights and we'll see how well this works. But you can see, here it just click right into place. Boom, here it is right here. Let's go ahead and kill the lights and see what it really does for you when you're rocking a Romeo and you gotta maybe do some car work. All right, so it's completely pitch black in here and you can see with the little Romeo by Energizer, I got plenty of room to work on my vehicle with it just being magnetized up to the hood of the car. So this is a really big help. I don't know about you, but there have been many times, you know, where I'm having to do something in, underneath the hood at night, oftentimes in the winter time, you know, with snow flying and stuff. And, you know, you got one hand trying to hold a flashlight, you know, or in your mouth or something, and then you're trying to, you know, do your work. This is a great little feature. The magnetized clip is fantastic on the little Romeo and really helps out with car work as well as a ton of other stuff. Here's another just quick example of what this flashlight will do for you. That, you know, hallway is really dark. It's about four yards from where I'm standing is the back of the wall. If I just click on the Romeo, boom. Full blown, the whole thing is really nice and bright, very clear. Then if we go down the stairs, again, got my Romeo right here with me. And then we go down into the bedroom. I mean, again, you know, that's about three yards away to that corner right there. Fully illuminates almost the half the room. You know, very easy to do that. So if you're using this, you know, in your house, maybe home defense, you're trying to clear, you know, a room, you heard a noise somewhere, you got your pistol with you, you know, whatever, you need something, or, you know, you just have it totally clicked off and then boom, you flash it really quick. You hear something, you see something. I mean, if someone looks right into that really large, wide throw, and they're going to go blind right away. They're going to lose, you know, a couple seconds you're going to have on them to be able to do what you need to do to defend yourself if need be. God forbid, 
But again, awesome with the Energizer Romeo. All right, everybody, we're out here tonight just doing a little night trek to test out a few lights, and we're going to be doing the Romeo, just kind of show you how it looks and rides and the throw at night, you know, around a campsite or something like that. Uh, it's attached here to my Flash 18 pack, and uh, we'll just kind of do a couple shots just so you get the idea of what the potential for this Romeo is. And I think, I mean, it's like a little multi-tool of a flashlight. So many ways to attach it to different things. It gives a good throw, and uh, yeah, I mean, even though it's 20 degrees, out here tonight. I'm uh, going to be testing this out so you can see what this Romeo can do. I love you guys that much. So let's go ahead look what this baby can do when it throws at night. Okay, so the Romeo is attached to my pack and you can see it's got a really wide throw and you know it just doesn't throw super far. We got this tall tree out here in the distance a little bit, probably about 20 yards and you know you can kind of see what's over there but not very clearly you wouldn't know you know if it, what was over there if there was an animal or a person you just know that there's some stuff over there and it's kind of bright so that's a uh, you know about 25 30 yards away and it's starting to get pretty weak on the throw real wide though this is definitely like a spotlight then if you bring it down you can see here this is about three yards away very nice bright throw and wide that's the nice thing too you know a lot of flashlights are pretty narrow this one's got the wide throw for this bush and then if we kind of rotate slowly over here, we've got this tree. And again, you know, if your pack's up against it, you need to look in your, into your pack, do some stuff like that, you're going to be able to get a good throw, you know, of a lot of campsite type of stuff. This isn't a long distance flashlight. You know, hiking at night, you're going to get a large, you know, swath of light over the trail so you know where you're walking. But distance, it's just not very good. We'll rotate here again. And you can see this, you know, this is this is about good distance. Further than that, and it starts to kind of get a little harder to see this, a bunch of this dead wood over here. And it kind of gets a little harder after that. You know, again, that's about three to four yards. Then the, the throw starts to get really wide and the clarity of what you're looking at just starts to wane pretty quick. But for a lot of campsite and walking on a trail, it's going to be fantastic. So you can see him coming up close, very bright, easy to see my flash pack. And then if I need to get into it and the 90 degree angle is nice. So I just don't have to, you know, mess with it as much. And then I can easily, let's see if I can put that up here with the gloves, easily get in there, see what's going on, pull out what I need to find my water bottle, whatever. And, uh, you know, just use it for this type of stuff. I mean, the, the Romeo is just going to do a great job around your campsite in particular. That's really what I think of when I think of this light, you know, around the house, you know, around the car, around the campsite, and, you know, night walking if you needed to, that type of stuff the Romeo is gonna do a great job with. So everyone, I've been rocking the Energizer Romeo here for a little while, and I gotta say, it is a fantastic little flashlight for around 25 bucks. Worth every penny, you, know, you can get them on Amazon, eBay, I'm sure you can probably find them at some Walmarts or you know other sporting goods stores. I love the lenses they give us down here, you know, near the bottom. That's a big plus that they give you, you know, so you can use the red. I definitely use the red pretty frequently. I love the just availability of the AA battery, you know, the life that it gives you, the wide throw you know it's definitely not the best flashlight for 25 bucks but i think it should definitely be uh in your kit particularly you know in maybe your car for those car work you know that we kind of showed you that you can do and magnetize it to the top of the roof of your car you know or those you know handymen you know that need it you're working a lot you know underneath sinks or you know in with computers and different things like that that you need you know just to be able to magnetize your little flashlight to something or you know make it stand up so you can kind of see what you're doing do hands free the energizer romeo just gives you a lot of options and I love it. It's a great little flashlight to own and you know for 25 bucks it ain't gonna break the bank. US made just an awesome awesome little flashlight. So thanks everybody for watching. I would recommend the Energizer Romeo for your kit. Thanks for watching. Stay equipped. Stay prepared. We'll see you out there.